Hi, welcome to another session on triangles. We have already discussed the theorems um, or the topics under triangles. Herein, we will be taking up uh, those past paper questions from the CBSE papers. I write down the first question under it. Mm. Let us, as being the first question, might be just very simple and easy. On one of the longer sides PQ of a rectangle PQRS we will draw the figure a point oh, a point X is taken such that S X square is equal to P X into PQ prove that triangle PXS and triangle XSR are similar. So let us draw let us draw a rectangle which is PQRS. P Q R S on the longer sides P Q this is P Q of the rectangle a point X is taken let us take X maybe here I write this as X such that S X square that means I need to join s x square is equal to p x into p q in triangle actually this is p x r and x s r as well that means i have to join this because we have to prove this p x s that is this small one equal to this one hmm? these two needs to be proved to be equal now it is given whatever is uh, in the figure sorry is PQR is being rectangle but it says SX square is equal to PX into PQ that means we can write this as SX by PX is equal to PQ by SX. Sx by Px can also be written as Pq instead of Pq we can, I can write Sr by Sx as because opposite sides of a rectangle are equal. Let us keep this as our first information which we have derived. Now we take this triangles Pxs and the triangle is x s r we can write p x by s x from the first equation i just reciprocated it and also this angle will be equal to this because s r is also parallel to p q So, I can write maybe I can name this as angle 1, I can name this maybe as angle 2. So, angle 1 is equal to angle 2. Therefore, triangle PXS is similar to XSR by SAS similarity. So, it was not that difficult though I move on to another question. Uh, for this let me draw the figure first mm -hmm. this 
figures says oh it says my figure doesn't seem to be making that a perpendicular though and not even an isosceles i can see it says it's an isosceles triangle with each side's given 2a and this is given to b a this point of intersection is termed as d now in this figure they say oh i write the question here determine the length of the altitude a d of an isosceles triangle a b c of sides 2a 2a and e so we have to find ad are these two triangles similar adb and adc let's see i take in triangles a d b and triangle a d c see a b is equal to a c it's already given because both sides are 2 a a d oh sorry a d is equal to a d that means they are common what else this angle these two angles will be 90 degree as ad is the perpendicular so angle adb will be equal to angle adc the both are 90 thereby making these two triangles similar by rhs congruency hmm? sorry uh, uh, i i uh, i made a mistake this i'm talking about the congruency because i need to derive something Uh, after this congruency, I wanted to to prove BD is equal to DC. We are not proving its similarity. It was congruence. BD equals to DC. In that case, if the whole BC is A, that means it will both be A by two, A by two. Now, as because we have to find AD, we will apply Pythagoras theorem in any of these um, two triangles. maybe take abd in that case hypotenuse square applying pythagoras theorem will be equal to ad square which we calculated as oh this that's we are supposed to calculate ad square so let it be as it is plus bd square which is a by 2 whole square so we're getting 4a square is equal to ad square plus a square by 4 i carry this solving part here that makes it 4 a square minus a square by 4 is equal to ad square so it is 16 a square minus a square by 4 equals ad square is a simple solution i'm getting 15 a square by 4 is ad square they were my making ad as root over of 15 a square by 4 so it's root 15 a by 2 units that's the length of the altitude which we were supposed to calculate quickly i move on to another question let me draw two figures here this is a triangle abc i draw a smaller one pqr abc this is p q r 
here it is given to be 12 cm we have to find this the rest of the information it says triangle a b c oh sorry it doesn't look good though uh, so mine uh, uh, is similar to sorry p q r so these two triangles are already given to be similar and they say area of triangle a b c is equal to four area triangle p q r that is four times p q r we have to find uh, q r now as because these two triangles are given to be similar we will write it is equal to the ratio of the squares of the proportion uh, corresponding sides so area a b c by area p q r the both are triangles we can write triangles here should be equal to b c square by q r square so area of a b c can be written as four area p q r by area of p q r this is equal to now b c square is 12 square by q r square that means what it is 4 by 1 is equal to 144 by q r square so q r square every time i'm writing o and then making it q i don't know why q r square is equal to 144 upon 4 so q r square is q r will be equal to root over of 144 by 4 so that's giving us 12 by 2 so q r is 6 centimeter so q r is 6 centimeter i hope uh, you got this right i now move on to give one question for you to solve though not a very difficult one else rather a simple simple one two poles of uh, it is two poles of height that's height six centimeter and Oh, they are given as meters I better write 6 meter and 11 meter stand vertically on the ground if the distance between their feet is 12 meter find the distance between their tops oh i didn't notice i kept writing and it had become it has become in uh, capital i don't mind you can still do the question i g uh, draw your own figure <coughs> i can give you some hint thereby you will get the answer by applying pythagoras theorem the answer will will be 13 units okay I hope you get that right. Thank you.